there have been some bands of flurries or even light snow showers coming through from Pennsylvania. So a few patches were showing up around Parkton. Here's another batch still near Cockeysville. And this piece here looks a little steadier. So if that can hold together, it would be aiming for Parkton once again and then maybe stretch all the way down towards Bel Air. So it's really the northern suburbs right now that have the chance to see some of that light snow this morning. Thankfully, we're well above freezing, so wouldn't cause any concern for the roads. Bigger concern for uh, parts of Pennsylvania, Western Maryland, as they get the heavier snow showers out of this event. And in fact, out towards a Western Maryland, six to nine inches of snow expected at least into tomorrow morning. The winds across the state will be really gusty today, gusting to about 24 miles per hour now and maybe some gusts up to 30, and that's going to add a significant chill to the temperatures. We're well, well above freezing with 36 in Westminster, 42 downtown Baltimore, 43 in Annapolis, but it already feels like the low to mid 30s right now. Even some spots feel like the 20s, like Westminster. That's what the wind chill is at right now. So the wind chill will basically keep it feeling like the 30s at most today. Actual temperatures around 46 for Baltimore, 45 for Easton, but it gets colder the farther west you go as you get deeper into the mountains, only in the 20s for the highs today. Baltimore falls to the 20s and low 30s tonight with dry weather, but it's still breezy, so the wind chill drops to the low 20s. Through tomorrow, the wind chill will start in the 20s, then move to the 30s by afternoon, as we're expecting out of the polar bear plunge as well. At least you will have dry weather and no issues on the roads. Seven day forecast still dry on Sunday, but the clouds increase. That's ahead of the light snow that we could see scattered on Monday. Even into next week, Wednesday, a few more pieces of energy could produce some more light snow and it does stay cold through the next seven days. Let's check the roads.